Good morning, Winchester Village. Happy Monday, December 19th, 2022. At this time, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Put your hand over your heart and repeat after me. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for our moment of silence. It's a Mindfulness Monday, and I want you to bow your heads and think about one thing you need to do to get ready to learn this week. Maybe it's shake off something bad that happened over the weekend. Maybe it's focus on a skill you want to get better at. But let's bow our heads and think about one thing we want to improve upon this week at Winchester. Let's bow. Great job, everyone. You may be seated. Don't forget to roar today, be respectful, own your learning and behavior, achieve great things, and be responsible. Today for lunch, we are having chicken patty on bun, peanut butter and jelly uncrustable, pepperoni pizza munchable, baby carrots with dip, fruit, and milk. Our salad today is the pepperoni pizza munchable, and our salad on Tuesday will be the yogurt, muffin, and string cheese. There will be no salad on Wednesday. All right, we've got some students celebrating their birthdays today. A very special happy birthday to Bougie Malimbe. He is celebrating his birthday um, this morning. Lillian Van Zant is also celebrating a birthday. I wanna continue um, and celebrate some of our friends who have birthdays while we are on winter break. So on December 22nd, a special happy birthday to Gael Alvarez Poveda. Sorry if I mispronounced that. Drayden Edwards is also celebrating a birthday on the 22nd. New Koi is celebrating a birthday on the 23rd. We've got a couple of Christmas babies. Happy birthday to Riley Morgan. She was born on Christmas Day, December 25th. And a special happy birthday to Corbin Frame. He was also born on December 25th. Uh, we've got a couple more December babies, um, December birthdays, um, and we'll announce those um, later in the week. All right, if you haven't noticed, today was much chillier, and that's why we wore our sweaters and sweatshirts, um, so that we can stay nice and comfy and cozy as we get ready for the winter holiday. And if you haven't noticed, it got much colder over the weekend, and it's going to continue to get cold throughout the week. So every day you need your thick coat, a hat, gloves to help keep your head, your hands, and your body warm. I know sometimes we just want to wear a little jacket or a hoodie, but we really do need to wear a thick winter coat. We need to make sure that we have our bus lanyards everywhere we go. That's how we know where we are. That's how we can find you faster on the buses. Um, just Friday, we had a little uh, situation where a mom said her kids hadn't found them. Uh, we were able to track on the bus um, scanners and we were able to find where their kids were and what time they got off. So boys and girls, please make sure you're wearing your bus lanyards. If you lose it, it's a $2 replacement fee. All right, a couple announcements of some winners, some kids and some classes that did some great things. So my first one comes from Mrs. Lines in the library. She wanted to share that Kal-El uh, Surface from Mrs. Wilcox's class was the winner in her Jolly Rancher guessing game. And not only did he win it, he had the perfect score. He was correct, the exact correct number. And that number in the Jolly Rancher jar was 134 Jolly Ranchers. So great job to all the boys and girls. Congratulations to Cal L for getting the correct number. And then on Friday, Mr. McDuffie sent me an announcement. He said, can I brag on my class a little bit? And I said, be absolutely happy to. He said that Dal, Sebastian, and Layla increased their SRI score by over 200 points. Great job, Dal, Sebastian, and Layla. And that Koi and Noi were right behind with 180 points. So great job to those five friends. He also said that 16 of 27 students increased their Evaluate Language Arts score um, by of with the top score increase of being 18% being Daniel and Carrie. And 
Their math evaluate score increased by 14% with 26 of 27 students increasing their score and the top score increases of 30% Noi and 40% Hamina. So great job to all the boys and girls from Mr. McDuffie's class. Thank you for sharing that humble brag. I really appreciated it. Well, today was comfy for Christmas. Tomorrow is going to be our Christmas sweater, our Christmas shirt day with blue jeans. So if you've got a fun Christmas sweater, Christmas t-shirt, um, you can wear that tomorrow with blue jeans. If you don't want to, that's okay. Then you just need to wear your school uniform. All right. We do have three days before our winter holiday, and I know that lots of our teachers have planned fun activities, and we have an extra special fun activity on Wednesday as a whole school. But what I want to on you to understand is you do not have to participate in any of these. So if we have friends making bad choices, being disrespectful, being unkind, hurting people, you will not be able to participate. We're not going to let people ruin the fun for everyone else. So you don't have to participate in our whole school event on Wednesday. We have some teachers who are staying back and they will be happy to put you in a classroom and have you work. Your teachers have planned lots of fun activities over the next two, three days. So if you're not following directions, if you're not being kind and showing respect, you don't have to participate. You will be happy to sit in the office. So I encourage you to be on your best behavior, make good choices so that anything that your teachers have planned that's gonna be fun, that's gonna be a little different, you get to participate in. But please know you do not have to participate. It is not a requirement. So if you make bad choices, I will be glad to pull you out and have you sit out while everyone else gets to have fun. So I hope I don't have to do that, which means we're gonna show kindness and respect we're gonna to listen to our teachers and follow directions, and we're gonna have a marvelous Monday and a great three-day week. So my challenge for you today, make good choices, be kind, keep your hands and feet to yourselves, and you're gonna have a great day. Remember, you are a fierce, ferocious wildcat, and you are capable of anything. Make it a great Monday, everybody. Have a great day. Bye, everyone.